Hey, ma'am. Hi. How you doing? Yeah, I'm OK. OK. What was your problem? The sewer was running out of the drain mm -hmm. out of the bathtub. Right, and everything was going underneath your house. Yeah. OK. So I'm going to go out now. I'm going to go underneath, OK? Oh, OK. OK. All right, ma'am. OK. Now, the bathroom is coming from that way. Take this light and see if you can shine down into that cast iron piece right there. Come on now. I, I got you it. Don't like an old man there. There's no lid on it. There's no lid. Like it's broken off. Good. T tell me when. Wow. Look at that. Yeah, you got roots right there. All okay. right. Oh. The only way the roots can get in there is you have a break. We can go down here about three feet down and cut that piece out and put another piece in there. So what would that cost? Normally, this is about $1,200 job. OK. <laughs> They run into the dark and old chesses and everything. You got chesses and stuff like that? Yeah. got the, I understand. I'll tell you what, OK, uh, when you meet people like that, you know, it just does something to you, you know? And I'm going to do all I can here to make sure she's OK. Can you do fire? At first, I was taken aback by Henry's giving such an extreme discount. OK. And I'll have somebody here tomorrow. But I thought about it, and I realized Henry works on commission, so he was taking money out of his own pocket. Henry was really trying to help her out. I mean, he wanted her house up and running again. Okay. That made me feel great. He was putting his heart out there, too, for her. So we're done here? Yeah, oh, yeah, we're done here. We're yeah, do yeah, more. I got to go to basketball practice, man. Practice? Yeah, I, I coach after work. You're welcome to come. Huh? You ain't got nothing else to do? I maybe we can, maybe do. we can let you run around, OK? Let's go. I decided to come along to the basketball practice. I watched Henry give and give and give all day. I want to see Henry outside of this environment. This is my wife dropping the kids off. Hi, right, babe. Thanks, yeah. Okay, how, are, how you doing, man? Y'all all right? Good, good, good. Since we had to work late today, she picked the kids up. And, and so if you didn't bring them, they wouldn't get here. Right. Some of them wouldn't get here, exactly. We just step in to keep the team together, to keep them off the street. Good defense, Mike. Good defense. Up high. Good job. What kind of a time commitment do, does Henry have to make to this? Four nights during the week. Why do you think he does it? He, he just loves children. He could work all day on his job, go pick up the children that need a ride, coach. Mm -hmm. That's kind of a pain in the rear end, though. Well, we do what we have to do. Yeah, I know. Mm -hmm. Henry, I, I got to compliment you on just the way you go about your work. You truly are a special person. Thanks. My heart went out to you watching you coach, because you're the most uh, selfless person I know. Mm -hmm. So I'm not happy about the way you and your wife have to go back and forth and, and find transportation for those kids. The company's going to give you a 15-person van to take all those kids to practice. <laughs> and I've got the keys. Oh, man. Uh, this is wonderful. Thank you. Let's talk about Henry for a second. How it's OK it about it. It's all right about Henry, as long as we take it. How, how about a promotion? Going to make you a field supervisor, first level manager in Rotorooter. Going to give you a raise. <sighs> Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. I'm overwhelmed. This is what I love. It's, it's for the kids. When you work hard, when you do the right thing, you know, it pays off, I guess.